big state lawmaker is trying to sweep up a mess made after a comment that she made on the House floor. Columbia State Representative Sheila Butt talking online right now about a comment about the victims of rape and incest that some are calling outrageous. Fox 17's Michaela Lewis on the story and in studio now with, uh, I guess, Sheila Butt's uh, explanation, for lack of a better term. Well, Scott, all of this started earlier this week. Democrats wanted to exclude rape and incest victims from a bill requiring 48-hour waiting periods for abortions. Right now, Republican Rep Sheila Butt is apologizing for what she calls the wrong word during the debate on Tuesday. Representative Sheila Butt isn't talking, but typing on her Facebook page about a comment she made while debating abortion restrictions. I had written comments to address the amendment excluding victims of rape and incest and meant to use the word verified. We understand that in most instances, this is not verifiable. Democratic Representative Sherry Jones heard it Tuesday and read Butt's statement Thursday, explaining rape or incest is often not verified at abortion clinics and hundreds of perps aren't held accountable. You probably meant what she said, but it's wrong. And many victims of rape and incest will tell you. The state needs to spend time pushing laws that will put a 48-hour limit on, on rape kits being processed. The Sexual Assault Center urges lawmakers to consider the policy impact on victims. The SAC offers its resources to anyone who wants to know how the community can better support survivors. I, I did not think anybody standing in the well had ever been to a clinic. They're making assumptions. Many are supporting the Columbia Rep online as Butt calls the 48-hour waiting period reasonable and helpful. Taking women's rights away. I hate that. We don't need people here in the General Assembly making choices for women. Representative Butt also states online, I understand those who will never agree with my stand for life and scrutinize my every word. I'm committed to being open, honest, and accountable. Michaela Lewis, Fox 17 News.